Fresno is known as the land of poets. Now the Valley's rich creative history is being celebrated in a big way. Action News anchor Dale Yurong shows us the large art piece taking shape in downtown Fresno. Francisco Letelier aims to lift spirits in the mural district. A wall on the side of the old Met Museum serves as an extra large canvas. The mural features a boy reading and birds. The birds represent the stories that are told, the stories that are read. Pages from books are also featured. This is a vision from the mind of Letelier, a Southern California artist. It's an allegorical image showing how our minds, imagination, and creativity can take flight. The building is home to CMAC, or the Community Media Access Collaborative. Local artist Mauro Carrera is also involved in the project, which honors Valley artists, poets, and writers. It tells you the importance of poetry and the written word, and how Fresno and the Central Valley is such a critical part of that. Frank Delgado of Arte Americas secured grant funding for the mural. We've had two recent uh, poet laureates, national poet laureates uh, in recent memory and a long list of authors and playwrights from William Soray and on down. The artwork has brought life to what used to be a big gray wall. It's wed to the community, to the people that are in the building now, to Arte Americas, which is over my right shoulder. Um, to the legacy and history of Fresno. The plan is to build a pocket park where people can enjoy an outdoor space so the mural serves as a backdrop. Dale Yurong, ABC 30 Action News. Major art projects typically get unveiled when they're complete, but when the canvas is a 50-foot tall building, you do things a little differently. Today, organizers provided an update on the massive mural being painted on the side of Fresno's former Met Museum. If you've driven through downtown recently, you've seen the colossal artwork going up at Van Ness and Calaveras. It's still only about halfway complete. The mural is a tribute to Valley artists, poets, and writers, and a vision from the mind of Francisco Letilier, a Southern California artist. He calls it a test of his creativity and his stomach for heights. In many ways, it's a huge wall. It's a challenge, <laughs> figuring out how to get up there was one thing, and then being up there is a whole other thing. The building is now home to CMAC, or the Community Media Access Collaborative. Arte America is located just down the street, secured grant funding for the mural. There's also a fundraiser underway to help pay for the mural and other art projects. You can buy tiles in the name of your favorite poet to go on the side of the mural. We posted more information on that on our website and mobile apps.